Hey guys, welcome back. We're actually going to do the Zero Tool missions, uh, the Protoss ones that we just got. Um, overall, I don't really like them that much because you don't get to use uh, the upgrades and cool little turn gadgets you get, but, you know, you gotta do them at some point and there's no, there's no advantage to waiting, so you might as well do them all in one go. So that's what we're gonna do now. Let's get started. Raynor, the Hounds of the Void are closing in. I impart my memory, my very essence, into this Eon crystal, so that you will see what I have seen, and that the future may yet have hope. Zeratul, what the hell have you gotten yourself into? Friend Raynor, long has it been since we stood together against the swarm. Since then, I have wandered the void in solitude, seeking an ancient prophecy rumored to foretell the return of the Zelnaga. My sojourn led me to a remote world known as Ulan. where I discovered fragments of the prophecy. Yet I was not the first to find them. It falls to you now, old friend, to relive my memories and believe. this place, Kerrigan. Do you hear them, Zeratu? Whispering from the stars. The galaxy will burn with their coming. Perhaps. But you won't live to see it. Thank you. 
fate cannot be changed. The end comes. And when it finds me, I shall embrace it. uncertain. There is always hope. Well done. Always nice seeing some more cutscenes. The prophecy is uncertain. Oh boy. Alright, well, let's get started. This is probably one of the best ones of the Protoss set. Mostly because you get blinking. I crab. will fulfill my calling. Dihydralisk. You don't have to actually kill these things. I'm going to just leave the them. The prophecy was divided into fragments, each kept at separate shrines. I must gather them and depart this world quickly. Rashagal, this chasm is vast. It is fortunate that I can phase through the shadows to the other side. Very fortunate. Alright. Well, let's just go stuff. attack this stuff then. The, his oh, blink is awesome. It's, it's actually pretty one of the neater things they gave to him. Spore crawlers can detect my presence. I should stun them with my void prism. Yes, yes, you should. We'll be balanced. There we go. We must not hesitate. Right, and next, I think we go. My allegiance is yours. Where do we go? Oh, uh, uh, there's a ramp here. Sorry, it's all very purple. In all blends in. Ire. Alright, this we is the bigger problem. Here's what you can do. I just run right past. This is the only problem. Is that the, we're in a very tight spot here. Alright, now I need to run. Ah, I'm already taking damage. Damn it. Ah, that's crappy. I was trying not to take damage, but you know, that's what you always try and do with this. I could run past it, I forgot about this other line. And it's like right in between, it doesn't quite work too well. That spore crawler can detect me from across the chasm. It must be destroyed. Yeah, we're going to we'll destroy it. So if you play it more carefully, it'll probably take no damage. Obviously you don't want to take damage, it's uh, you know very undesirable. I'm right now just getting all these guys, because there's a... I think there's something up ahead. Glory to the first okay, they're done. That overseer can see through my cloak. I'd best stun it with my void prison before crossing this chasm. Just get rid of all the hydralisks. Okay, we're done. In the service of iron. The first fragment of the prophecy. Soon all will be made clear. Very cinematic. <laughs> Why not surrender yourself to oblivion, Zeratul? Wouldn't it be better to end your struggle now than witness the final agonizing moments of your species? El Haldin. So much for Kerrigan's reprieve. Oh, Shakuras. Luckily, the stalkers come in. Just uh, a little bit of blink micro. There you go. I'll have full health. Greetings, exalted one. We are here in the service of High Templar Karas. He is nearby. Your presence is most welcome. Let us keep moving. We are one. Permit us to destroy their defenses before we proceed. 
Yeah, we're doing I that. Will erase the demons These are like a lot of like cloaking puzzles kind of thing. So you just gotta pay attention to when when you're attacked. Try not to take any damage as usual. Though they had that stupid bouncing attack. Alright, where is the other one? There he is. Come on over. Alright, he's done. And we'll go get that guy. Just, uh, you know, void, void prison it before you go down. And then make sure the these guys don't actually get hit by the Ultralisk at all. Because as you notice back there, uh, you know, Ultras are not exactly the most favorable thing to go up against. Alright, we're done with that. And also put Zero Tree on the front. Oh, I kind of like this mission. This one's actually neat. That patrol of brood lords must be dealt with cautiously, or we will be torn asunder. Darkness. You Darkness. There you go. Let's pick him up one by one. Now, get out of here. You require skills. There you go. Don't deal with him. Oh, he took, he took eight damage. That sucks. Oh well. Alright, we can probably go take care of this one too, as soon as we get... As soon as uh, we get Void Prison back. It's like... Uh, 12... Well, sorry, it's a 22 second cooldown. What? Oh, crap. He's on the wrong side. You require my skills. Leave zero tool for that. It's his fault. I did it perfectly. <laughs> Every more of them here. And they're done with that. So let him handle that. And he's done. Look, look how much damage he does. It's like over 200. Wow. He's one badass. Alright. Let's keep hitting this way. Oh, aerial assault. Prepare for an aerial attack. Brace yourselves, my brethren. We are one. Alright, we can still take up that guy really easily. I'm not sure why they're not exactly noticing me too much here. Which an aerial attack is it? <laughs> There's a lot of ground forces there. That was, I think, the worst part. Hey there. Nice of you to join us. Alright. The Queen of Blades built hatcheries here. She seeks to subvert this sacred world. I shall put an end to that plan. Alright, and move back slightly. And Void Prison his ass. <laughs> it's just, you know, it, it's it, honestly it's just picking him off. Uh, just going through very, kind of like, carefully as well. That's also very important. Alright. Well, there's that guy there. Let's just wait for him to pass by. We can technically just bum rush him, but you know. There you go. Now we just wait for the other one. I will erase the Wherever he is. There he is. The past. We could void prison if we wanted to, but it's not really necessary. I will and we're done. That's it. Just uh, taking out the hatcheries. By the way, there is a lot of nice research to be done, which is why I'm actually doing it like right now. I'm, I'm kind of insisting that uh, I do, like. I'm kind of insisting the minute you get it, you just do it because you're gaining no advantage by waiting, but you gain all the advantages by doing it early. It's like three, three Zerg and three Chaos research. It's nice. There we go. Glory. And there we go. Another shrine. The second fragment of the prophecy. My task is nearly complete. Kind of fun just to see. Alright, new entryway. Your hope is an illusion. Old fool. 
Oh. She's so not if nice. You so easily read my mind, Kerrigan. You'll see that I'll never give up so long as hope remains. Alright. Careful now. Huh. Kerrigan has set guards to bar our way. It could be a trap. Let's get the let's we get over here. Take them out carefully, one at a time, or risk being overwhelmed. Well, you don't have to do it one at a time. It's probably a little overkill. But you can do it most of them. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh wait, wait, no, we can't do that. Why does he care? You address me. He just doesn't give a fuck. All right, here, let's just board person you. In the service of fire. There we go. Still have detection range. And we'll just take him out right now. And you just don't really want to attack me. What have I ever done to be the lists? Alright, and we'll go get that. They didn't even attack me, you see? They did the animation, but no attack. If you do it quick enough, that's that's what's possible. Really well made. All these puzzles. Love them. Alright. Oh, let's see what's up. The fun, the funness that's up here. The painlings spew acid when they die. Stalkers, take them out from a distance. Uh, he has to hold position down there because he will tend to attack them. Very well. Is the one problematic part, which is that we don't quite get our thing back until the very end. So we took a bit of damage there. Oh, uh, you know what I should have done? It's because you're supposed to take out the the uh, uh, spore, the the little crawler things here. That gives you enough time to do it. Uh, that was my bad. These little creep tumors. Ah, uh, those little pieces of shit. I forgot. Well, now you know for next time. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. First, we're gonna go down here though, because uh, all the other hatcheries tend to be in hidden places, and this is one of them. This hatchery must be destroyed if I am to keep the Queen of Blades from subverting this land. Now we're going down here because I don't actually trust that. I will be redeemed. Something's gonna pop out. I just know it. Glory. Yeah, can't take out that, but we can run away with stuckers. I don't think he comes that back anymore, uh, so you don't have to worry too much. But just in case, I'll uh, make sure they have blink for the most part. Yeah, he doesn't come back. Oh no, he does come back. Oh, it's another new one. Well, we'll just, uh, you know, he, he can handle this on his own. And there goes two pieces of research. Alright, we'll head we'll keep heading this way. And there's a, I think it's a tarp. Yeah, that was totally a tarp. Unfortunately, these guys can't cloak at all. So we gotta just go through this kind of address me? really slowly. Oh, spine crawlers! Kill them before they can take root and attack. We will erase the demons. Okay, we got we got most of them, which is nice. Uh, the re the rest aren't that difficult to deal with. Just literally this thing. We must not hesitate. And we, will, we have to run back. No! Okay, good. You, you can see him twitching, he just wanted to get me. In the service of and we can get we can get him because we're like we're literally right outside the range of this. Alright. And we'll go get this guy when he comes back. Ta da! Minimal damage. Alright. 
Uh, he's up there somewhere. Antaro Tassadar, Prelix Zeratul. I am High Templar Karas. My force tracked the Queen of Blades to this world, yet we know not what she seeks. Kerrigan and I were both drawn here to uncover an ancient prophecy. With your aid, I pray we can discover it before her. It is an honor, Great One. Lead on. It is indeed an honor. Alright. So, maximum health. We got the maximum amount of stalkers. I've placed the Ultralis in a void prison. Bring it down, Kallus. Yeah, they, they had, unfortunately, a few bit of uh, units there. Yes, I can. I always like to avoid prison with the other one, so that one goes down. And then that one's not nearly a, as much of a problem anymore. Must be destroyed, or the Zerg reinforcements will overwhelm us. Hey, just have them up here. So you just use him to basically just snipe the Midas worms. So many zealots. Zeratul has destroyed their worms. Press on. Oh. There you go. We got it. Now don't head. <laughs> don't go in there just yet. Uh, just wait a second. That's where you want to go. Uh, two of them still need to come up here. Let me just wait for them. I am the voice of the eclipse. Sucks that I have to wait. All right. And you want to bring all of them over here. Yeah, these two still need to charge up their thing. There you go. And this is where the last one is. The queen of blades seeks to pervert this world with that hatchery. I must destroy it. Remember for this, you have to be on the high ground to actually see this over here. It's really weird. I, I missed it my first time and I was pissed off. Okay, so what I normally do here is I just take a pot shot. And then Zeratul. Kill most of them. No, 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 no. Not quite. There's still that one more spine. I think we can do without it, though. There we go. And we're done. We don't really have to kill everything here, just just the uh, the hive. Let's, uh, let's go, go all the way here. It is done. All of Kerrigan's hatcheries are destroyed. There is yet hope for this world. Final piece of the prophecy. It speaks of one who shall break the cycle of the gods. Most ominous. But if the Queen of Blades seeks this prophecy, we must keep it from her. The rest is obscured. What? You might peel away the prophecy's layers, Zeratul. But you cannot outrun the doom that awaits us all. We cannot prevail against so many. I will stand against the Queen of Blades while you escape with the fragments. I will not abandon you. The prophecy is more important than either of us. Reveal its secrets, Seratul. The future rests on it. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten, brother. Alright, time to run the, the fuck away. Hey, look, maximum heals. I must get to the Void Seeker before the Zerg overwhelm me and the prophecy is lost. Yes, I know. We're going to the Void Seeker, don't worry. We can just... Oh crap, all oh, that guy's gonna die. Aw, oh, you poor, poor guy. Whatever. 
He didn't go in the right place. It's his own damn fault. Must not All right, and we'll just uh, prison that. Now I shall become one with the column. He just died, just as I was escaping. I cannot decipher the fragments on my own. Yet I know who might interpret them. The preservers of Zakul. If they cannot, I fear this entire universe will burn. And we're done that. Uh, well, I didn't get. I didn't have. I had him suffer life because I did something dumb. Uh, you don't do anything dumb. That's that's a simple one. And I already. I had four stalkers at the end, so that one's really really easy. You should get that your first time, anyways. Brutally, you're trying to preserve all your units, so you know, having four at the end, they're not the hardest thing in the world. But unfortunately, you get no money for this. It kind of sucks. That's why I, I hate doing it. Um, especially the last one. The last one's a pain in the ass, especially on Brutal. Hey, we get additional research and stuff. And so here's, uh, I guess, more about the whatever the Zerg organism is. And uh, here we go. Got a bin in both. And this one, uh, you either have the Predator, which is um, some retarded unit that attacks everything around it, built, built from a factory. Um, or you can have the Hercules, which is a transport ship uh, that all deployed troops survive if, if it's killed. And uh, you take that one, basically. <laughs> this one's. They're both equally kind of not too useful, but this one's probably the better of the two because you can find use for that in some missions. This one you really can't. Alright, let's go see what everyone's up to. How did you become such good buddies with those freaky Protoss? All I hear is they kill Terrans like you and me on sight. Some of them would. But some others would fight to the death protecting people like us. I helped them defend their homeworld from the Zerg during the First War. When Kerrigan came back leading the swarm, I helped him out again. The real big on loyalty. Damn, Jimmy. Almost sounds like you respect them. I wouldn't expect you to understand, Tychus. We have a very special guest today, Crown Prince Valerian. Thank you so much for joining us, Highness. Thank you, Kate. It's wonderful to be here. Let me get right to the question on everyone's mind. Is there anyone special in your life right now? Truth be told, Kate, I've had a crush on you for many years. Oh, stop. <laughs> but in all seriousness, with the Zerg invasion, there's little time for such things. I've been studying military tactics under General Warfield, and whatever spare time I have is devoted to statecraft. It's my goal to be the best emperor our people could ask for. When the time comes, of course. Wonderful. Now I've got two of them to worry about. <laughs> Statecraft? Really? Good to see you, brother. I've been... Wait. I can see it in your eyes. You've seen into the spirit world. The Protoss. He gave you... A crystal. And now you've been seeing what he's seen. That ain't nothing to do with you. Stay out of my head, Tosh. Have it your way. But you want to trade careful when you go looking into the beyond. If you need me, you know where I'll be. Uh-huh. Alright, let's see the bridge. It's Matt God. How long was I down in the lab, Matt? You've been gone for hours, sir. You've been in the lab all that time? I used the Eon Crystal Zeratul gave me. I'd swear it only lasted a few minutes. So vivid. Zeratul's been searching for a Zelnaga prophecy about the end of the universe. There's more. I just haven't got to it yet. Uh-huh. It's, like it's like a good book. My shift is almost over. 
Little drinking, little shut eye, some more drinking, then right back to work. <laughs> Alright, well, we're done with that for now then. Uh, so we'll do the next ones next time. So bye.